pancreatic cancer has the highest mortality rate of all the major cancers known till date. For all stages combined together, the 5-year relative survival rate is only 11%. Even for the small percentage of people diagnosed with the local disease, the 5-year rate is only 42%. Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues, your daily dose of health and medical news. I am Dr. Nandita Mohan and today I am going to talk about how exercise can help fight against the pancreatic cancer and boost the immune system. Aerobics as an exercise has always helped us to reprogram our minds, also our immune system. And this has shown to even reduce the pancreatic tumor growth, thereby amplifying the effects of immunotherapy. The study is published in the Cancer Cell Journal and it provides a new insight into how the body's immune system, which is designed to attack the foreign invaders like bacteria, can also evenly recognize the cancer cells as abnormal. The exercise induced, it increases in levels of the hormone adrenaline that causes the change to the immune system, including the activity of cells that respond to the signaling protein interleukin-15. The current study found that exercise does promote the survival of CD8 T cells that have been sensitive to IL-15 and also doubles the number of them which is often homing to pancreatic ductal adenocarcinoma tumors. Now such effector T cells have been shown by various other studies to be capable of killing these cancer cells. Other tests found that aerobic exercise for a 30-minute period 5 times a week did reduce the rate of cancer formation by 50% in pancreatic ductal adenoma carcinoma cases and reduced tumor weight by 25% in the other group. Hence, the authors concluded that aerobic exercise does affect the immune microenvironment within pancreatic tumors. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.